Welcome back to Primetime News. And a special welcome once again to our viewers on OneSpotMedia.com. Up first this evening, a battle is brewing between the Director of Public Prosecutions, DPP Paula Llewellyn, and Senior Deputy DPP Katian Pike. In a letter to the government, Ms. Pike not only called for a new DPP, but appealed for an investigation into the operations of the office. But as Kelisha Williams reports, Ms. Llewellyn fired back, describing Ms. Pike as a bully who has always been bitterly resentful and upset that she is not the boss. It's a clash between prosecutors. First, senior DPP Kathy Ann Pike sends a letter to the Prime Minister and the Justice Minister not to extend the tenure of DPP Paula Llewellyn and select a new DPP. She stressed that there is a plethora of problems plaguing her office which should be investigated. One, Ms. Pike said she and other prosecutors have concerns about the growth and validity of the office under Llewellyn's leadership. In fact, she said some prosecutors have expressed a lack of confidence in her leadership. Two, Ms. Pike indicated that under the office of the current director, the office has consistently lost some of the most gifted legal minds and the attrition rate has never been as high as currently being experienced in the past seven years in the history of the office. And she indicated that there are many persons seeking to leave. Three, she noted that of the 56 prosecutors employed to the office of the DPP, less than 50% have experience of five years and over. She noted in an era of trial readiness and case management, inexperienced prosecutors are being asked to represent the state's interest in complex and serious cases. She also cited the absence of the prosecutors from the DPP's office appearing before the UK-based Privy Council since 2008. Ms. Pike suggests the government conduct a poll to find out whether the members of staff are in support of Llewellyn's leadership. But hours after the letter dropped on Friday, another bombshell which saw DPP Paula Llewellyn in defense mode. In a six-page response, Ms. Llewellyn said although she's an experienced prosecutor, Ms. Pike has always been bitterly resentful, extremely upset, and expressed feelings of hurt and disrespect to me and other members of staff because she has not been placed to head a unit. Ms. Llewellyn noted that in her efforts to be fair, she has preserved with Pike and ignored her behavior. In another twist, Ms. Llewellyn said it is only she and other senior deputies who have been successful in not being target of her bullying and intimidation. As it relates to the DPP's office at the Privy Council, Ms. Llewellyn said the information as it relates to the representations in the Privy Council would never be revealed to Ms. Pike, as it would only be revealed on a need-to-know basis. She indicated that her HR director has advised that they will have to invite the Office of the Services Commission to conduct a full investigation into the unprofessional conduct of Ms. Pike, which has put the office into disrepute in order to rid the process of any semblance of bias and ascertain the truth concerning this matter. Kelisha Williams, TVJ News.